Hello everyone, you are welcome to solve this nice exponential equation, which is 4 to the power x plus 2. This is equal to 30. So, what is the value of x? Now, solution from here, we have that 4 to the power x plus 2. This is in the form of 8 to the power n plus m, which we can express as 8 to the power n times 8 to the power m. So applying this exponent property here, we'll have 4 to power x multiplied by 4 to power 2. This is equal to 30. So here we have 4 to power x multiplied by 4 to power 2. This is 16. This is equal to 30. So let's divide both signs by 16. By 16. So that now, here we have 4 to power x. This is equal to now let's simplify here, we have by 2 here, that divided by 2, this is 15, 16 divided by 2, this is 8. So here we have 15 over 8. To so solve for the value of x, we introduce logarithm on both sides, so that here we have rog 4 to power x, this is equal to rog 15 divided by 8. So you find that rog 4 to power x, this is in the form of rog 8 power n, which we can express as n rog rog a. So this is the power root property of logarithm. Applying this property, rog 4 to power x becomes x rog 4. So this is equal to rog 15 over 8. The next step here is to divide both signs by rog 4. So that now here, we have x is equal to rog 15 over 8 divided by rog 4. So we find that rog 15 over 8, this is in the form of rog a over b, which we can express as rog a, subtract rog b. Now, applying this property, we will have that the value of x will be equal to rog 15 divided by rog 4, subtract rog 8 divided by rog 4. The next step from here, we can express 15 as 5 multiplied by 3. So let's substitute this. So here we have rog. 5 times 3 divided by rog 4 subtract rog 8 divided by rog 4. So if we find that rog 5 times 3, this is in the form of rog A multiplied by B, which you can essentially express as rog A plus rog B. Now applying this property, here we'll have x equal to rog 5 divided by rog 4 plus rog 3 divided by rog 4 then subtract rog 8 divided by rog 4 the next step is that we can express 8 as 2 to power 3 and we can express 4 as 2 to power 2 so substituting this, we'll have x equal to rog 5 divided by rog 4, which is rog 2 to power 2, plus rog 3 divided by rog 4, which is 2 to power 2, subtract rog 8, which is essentially rog 2 to power 3, divided by rog 4, which is 2 to power 2. So now applying the power root property, we'll have here rog 5 divided by rog 2 to power 2 becomes 2 rog 2 plus here we have rog 3 divided by rog 2 to power 2 which is 2 rog 2. Now subtract rog 2 to power 3 which is essentially 3 rog 2 divided by 2 rog 2. 
So essentially here, rock 2 and rock 2 simplifies. So that now, here we have x equal to half rock 5 divided by rock 2. Then plus half rock 3 divided by rock 2. Subtract 3 over 2. So we find that rock 5 divided by rock 2 and rock 3 divided by rock 2. This is in the form of rock A divided by rock B, which we can express as rock A to base B. So applying this logarithm property, then we have that x will be equal to half rock 5 to base 2 plus half rock 3 to base 2 subtract 3 over 2. Now this is the value of x. This is the value of x. So let's verify that this value of x actually satisfies the equation by following these steps. Now let's verify that this value of x satisfies the equation. Now if you recall here, we end that fourth power x plus 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 30. But given that 4 to power x plus 2, this is in the form of 8 to power n plus m, which we can express as 8 to power n times 8 to power m, we transform this to 4 to power x times 4 squared, which is equal to 30. So here we have 4 to power x multiplied by 4 squared, this is 16, and this is equal to 30. So let's divide both signs by 16 here. So essentially here, we have 4 to power x. This is equal to, now, this is 15 over 8. So let's substitute the value of x so that we have 4 to power x, which is half rock 5 to base 2 plus half rock 3 to base 2 then subtract 3 over 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 15 over 8. Let's check if this is true. We can express 4 as 2 to power 2. So here we'll have 2 to power 2 multiplied by, we have a half, rock 5 to base 2, plus half rock 3 to base 2 subtract 3 over 2 so this is supposed to give us a value of 15 over 8 so let's simplify here so in so here we have 2 to power this is rock 5 to base 2 plus now this is a half so 2 and 2 simplifies here so this is plus rock 3 to base 2 then subtract Again, we have 3 over 2, so 2 and 2 here simplifies, so we have minus 3. This is supposed to give us a value of 15 over 8. Let's check if this is true. So 2 to power rock 5 to base 2 plus rock 3 to base 2 minus 3. This is in the form of a to power n plus m, which we can express as a to power n times a to power m. And also, this is in the form of a to power n minus m, which we can express as a to power n divided by a to power m. So applying this exponent property, then here we have 2 to power rock 5 to base 2, multiplying by 2 to power rock 3 to base 2, divided by 2 to power rock 3 to base 2, this is supposed to give us a value of, that is 15 over 8. So this is, this is actually 2 to power 3. This is 2 to power 3. We have 3 here. So this is 2 to power 3. So now here, 2 to power of 5 to base 2 and 2 to power of 3 to base 2. This is in the form of m to power of 8 to base m which is supposed to give us a value of a. So applying this property, then 2 to power of 5 to base 2 
this will give us a value of 5. And 2 to power rog, 3 to base 2, this is going to give us a value of 3. Let's substitute this. So here we have 5 multiplied by 3, divided by 2 to power 3. So this is 2 to power 3. This is supposed to give us a value of 15 over 8. So 15 times 3 here, this is 15, divided by 2 to power 3, 2 to power 3, this is, so we are saying that 2 to power 3, this is the same thing as 8, so we'll have 8 here, this is equal to 15 over 8. So it's true that the left add side is equal to the right add side, and this implies that the value of x, which is equal to a half rock 5 to base 2 plus a half rock 3 to base 2 subtract 3 over 2 satisfies the equation satisfies the equation so kindly follow the steps like this video and subscribe see you in the next video